So good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to the marriage of Caitlin and Leah. They now wish to affirm their relationship in your presence as they start their new life together. You are the best cousins ever! you when you are sad comfort you when you are sad whatever life may bring whatever life may bring I will always love you I will always love you beautifully done right Leah Caitlin as I take you to be my wife Caitlin as I take you to be my wife I promise to love you I promise to love you to honor and respect you to honor and respect you to honor and respect you deep breath I will stand by you I will stand by you and be true to you always. And be true to you always. I will care for you. I will care for you. Laugh with you when you're happy. Laugh with you when you're happy. Comfort you when you're sad. Comfort you when you're sad. Whatever life may bring. Whatever life may bring. I will always love you. I will always love you. Leah, I give you this ring. Leah, I give you this ring. As a symbol of our love. As a symbol of our love. And as a lasting reminder. And as a lasting reminder. Of the vows we've made. Of the vows we've made. Here today. Here today. Slide that down her finger. Perfect fit. Hold that on the tip of her finger. And say, Caitlin, I give you this ring. Caitlin, I give you this ring. As a symbol of our love. As a symbol of our love. And as a lasting reminder. And as a lasting reminder. Of the vows we've made. Of the vows we've made. Here today. Here today. Slide that down her finger. Perfect. So. Caitlin and Leah, you have both made the declarations prescribed by law and made a solemn and binding contract with each other in the presence of your witnesses, family and friends gathered here today. This is the first day of a new chapter in your lives together and one that we hope will be filled with great love and happiness. It therefore really does give me the greatest of pleasure to say you are now wife and wife. Congratulations! <laughs> For a year now I've been waiting See that look in your eyes 
I've been open for a love like you For a long, long time We got laughter, we got tears We got each other too From this moment we are here to stay There ain't nothing we can't do Congratulations, Caitlin and Leah. I'm so grateful for all the ways that you've loved me and my family. So grateful for you and I hope you have a lifetime of happiness. Leah and Caitlin, it's been such a special day. You both look so beautiful today. Just wish you every success for your future. It is with love, joy and pride that we are here today. It is clear for all to see that Caitlin has found her other half in Leah. Caitlin is truly lucky to have found her true love, her soulmate with Leah, and that will truly make Anna, Richard and our family happy knowing they are perfect for each other. We couldn't imagine anyone better, or thankfully as patient as Leah, for Caitlin to start this new adventure with. We wish you a lifetime of happiness, as you are now not starting only this journey as a married couple, but also parents very soon. We are very proud of you both. Mum says, don't worry, she'll be there to change a nappy. And Cakey, you will always be our Cakey bum, even though you're starting out this new journey as a wife and mother. Leah and family, we'd like to officially welcome you to our family. Remember, we will love you forever and that you'll, we'll be there for you no matter what in life. If you know Leah, you would know that she has a heart of pure gold. Yeah. <laughs> and would do absolutely anything for family and friends. However busy her life is, she will always make time to make sure that we're okay with either a phone call or FaceTime. We are so lucky to have you in our lives. I had a speech written and I threw it away, it wasn't good enough. Then I wrote another speech and I threw that one away, it wasn't good enough. And again and again and I thought, I'm just going to say what's going to come into my head. And I want to start by just paying homage and respect to Leah and Caitlin. People have come up to me today and said you've made a wonderful function. Well, I haven't. Those two wonderful girls have done this all themselves. And I just think we should all just say thank you, thank you, thank you. It is unbelievable. The 3rd of September 2015, the best day of my life. From the moment we met, I just knew you were special. I've never clicked with someone so fast. Before we even met, we arranged to wear the same outfit. Until today, nothing's changed. We didn't even arrange this. For years now, we've had this ongoing joke where I, did, I asked Caitlin to describe me in three words. Caitlin purposely winds me up and describes me in words that I think are bland, such as nice, friendly, and kind. So Caitlin, I'm going to tell you how it's done, so take some notes. <laughs> Three words to describe my wife, Caitlin. You're fiercely loyal, not only to me, but to your friends and family, and I think everyone in here will agree when I say that. You Jay, you always ask me why I love you. <laughs> and of course I answer the usual, you have a kind heart, you're funny, you make me happy, and you always laugh at me and tell me how bland those words are. <laughs> There's no amount of words in this world that could ever describe the connection we have. You are my soulmate and I'm so excited to spend the rest of my life with you. I can just imagine us now, two old ladies in a care home playing pranks on the other residents, having our cups of tea whilst our grandkids come to visit. I feel like every friendship has a story. And you guys are probably expecting the beautiful story of how we, how we met each other, which is indeed beautiful, 
we were a lot younger, struggling with our mental health. We needed each other. And we all clicked and we became the best of friends. You two slowly became girlfriends and then adopted me as a little brother. I remember being so happy for you, but that's not our story. <laughs> it doesn't have to be super emotional or touching and I think you know what story's coming. And it starts when I was a lot younger, probably around 14, although I looked and sounded about 10 years old. You guys came round and at this time I'd have like an awful bowl cut fringe. It was awful. Um, Cause I'm no hairstylist, so yeah, just imagine it. But one day we were all in my room and the two of you found my hair cut underneath my wardrobe. So I would cut my hair and I'd hide it under there and you just pulled it out clump by clump. And I've never seen you both look so confused but find it so hilarious. And I can't tell you why I hid my hair under there. But I did and I've got to own it and we laugh about it still to this day. You know it's kind of funny How a room full of things Feels completely empty When you're not in the wings How could I have known The fortune I would find A piece deep in my bones The beauty day and night And you Anywhere I feel like home Home isn't where we live It's living by your side 